So last night I saw Black Pan- the Black Panther, um, which is out in theaters, I guess, currently since yesterday, uh, Thursday. Uh, opening weekends this weekend. Uh, today's Friday, so uh, it was anticipated to be one of the best Marvel movies out right now, or superhero movie in general. And uh, I won't spoil anything. I mean, I'll just talk about my thoughts on it in case you haven't seen it. Um, great movie, worth the watch. Um, Chadwick Bos- Bosman, Bos- Bosman, Bosman or Bosman? I'm not sure how you pronounce that. Amazing job. I actually like him as Black Panther. I'd seen him in, uh, in, uh, I think it was called 42, the, the movie with Jackie Robinson, when he played, uh, the baseball player. And I liked him a lot in that movie. Uh, when he was introduced in, uh, Civil War as Black Panther, I thought it was pretty cool too. I, I like this choice. Um, I got the, it's weird because you see him in one movie and then you see him in, as Black Panther. And he got the African accent going. It's pretty cool. Um, it takes off literally like right after the events of uh, uh, Civil War. It's like a week, a week after. If you've seen Civil War, the part where <clears throat> T'Challa's dad uh, dies in an explosion, it's like a week after that. I believe they said it's, it's in the beginning of the movie. So it takes like right right after Civil War. Um, he his sister's in it. Um, the character, uh, the main uh, antagonist, the villain. Is uh, Eric uh, Killmonger? Killmonger? Yeah, Killmonger. Uh, played by Michael B. Jordan, and I thought he did a phenomenal job too. And playing his character, it's um, it's kind of hard to see him not as uh, Creed because that was the last time I saw him in was Creed. So I'm like, ah, it's baby Creed, but whatever. It's uh, Eric in this movie. Uh, he did a phenomenal job too. The whole cast, everything was just great. Um, I love the story. Uh, I love the message that the story had at the end, uh, and and you kind of sympath- you get both. Um, I guess uh, what do you call it? Uh, point of views. You see, you know, this this guy's. Uh, you see T'Challa's way of thinking. You see, you in, and you see Eric's way of thinking and why he's doing what he's doing, and you sympathize for him, and you understand T'Challa's uh, position, all that. Um, what's this? Uh, I don't know how to pronounce her name. Uh, you you know her as if you see Walking Dead, you know her as Michonne from The Walking Dead. She was really cool. All right, straight badass in this movie, just like she is in The Walking Dead. Her and her her posse. Um, Sh- Shuri Shuri Shuri. I don't know how to pronounce her her name. I think it's Shuri. It's S H U R I. Um, that's uh, the Black Panther's kid sister. Really funny. I liked her a lot. She was she was pretty funny. She brought the humor to the a lot of humor to the movie. Um, and there was a couple of parts that just were pretty cool because you see uh the, you probably seen in the previews where they're flying they're flying into Wakanda, so you see nothing but forest all of a sudden it comes to this highly technical technologically advanced city. Um, that was pretty cool. Forest Whitaker's in it too. Um, what else happens? Ulysses Claws in it too. He doesn't have that many parts. He, he got a couple of parts in it, but um, what I thought was pretty cool also was uh, his suit. If you notice in the previous how it turns purple and all that, I guess uh, anytime the suit gets hit, it builds, uh, collects kinetic energy, and he could just blow that out. Um, towards the end, the fight scene at the end was pretty cool. Uh, the fight scene between Michael B. Jordan's character and Chad. Chadwick's character was pretty cool. Black Panther was still longer. Um, man, I don't want to say too much. So, uh, overall, great movie. Uh, definitely should check it out. Um, we saw it at uh, AMC Do- Dolby Dolby Cinema, uh, and I guess this weekend, or at least I saw on Facebook that this weekend, if you go see the movie at the Dolby Cinema AMC, you get like a free poster flyer thing. What it is is the cover of one of the Black Panther comics. Still pretty cool. I mean, you get something. Um, but yeah, I mean, that's just my, my, my thoughts on it. It was just a great movie. Uh, great message. Um, and yeah, I mean, I, I, like you said, you, you, you sympathize for, for the villain. You understand his where he's coming from. I thought that was great. And kind of even root for him towards the end. Um, also, you know, the message with uh, T'Challa, Black Panther, was pretty cool. 
there are two movie uh at the end you know most marvel movies have credit scenes at the end this one has two so it has one after after a couple of credits roll and then after all the credits roll there's another one so i won't say what that what they are just you know i don't want to spoil it for no one uh, but yeah just know it's a great movie uh yeah, that's, that's my thoughts on it. So, uh, if you've already seen it, you want to give your thoughts on it, uh, do so in the comment section. Or if you haven't seen it and you want to share what you know, you're know you anticipating with this movie, uh, go ahead and do so in the comment section as well. So, that's all I got. Uh, you guys have a great weekend. And if you go watch this movie, you will not be disappointed. Alright, bye.